my gosh. Hi. It's so good to see you. It's been way too long. Oh my gosh. I can't even... It's so good to see you. When was the last time that we saw each other? I think it must have been... Well, months ago. Oh man, how are you doing? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, this year has been... I mean the past year, 2020. It was crazy. I hope that you are feeling healthy and good and in high spirits. Oh yeah, I know, me too. It's been a real struggle to adjust to kind of a new way of doing life. <laughs> Most things, right? I mean, everything's been affected. Work, home life, social lives. It's been crazy. Yeah. Oh my gosh. I know. I know. Well, I know it's it's been tough and it's been tough for me too and there's a few things that I've kind of found work for me to help me lift my spirits I guess you could say and I was thinking that maybe some of those things might work for you too I know we're all different but I always really when people share with me the things that they do to feel calm and centered and happier and so I like sharing that with my friends too yeah <laughs> well um I found that sound works really well for me I think that it's one of the senses that I feel kind of can shift my frame of mind the most and I've lately been doing self sound baths <laughs> does that sound indulgent? <laughs> yeah well there's just certain sounds that I found just work so well to relax me and completely almost I don't know transport me to like a different place of mind I guess you could say and I've brought a couple of items with me here and I was thinking that if you're up for it only if you're up for it I could do a little sound bath for you what do you think? is that weird? <laughs> okay, good okay, so I'm gonna show you the first item and let's see what you think okay so, this might look familiar to you, wind chimes, right? But if you can see here, you see that? It says Koshi, so it's a particular brand of wind chimes that to me sounds heavenly. So there's four different kinds of koshi chimes there's one that corresponds to earth one that corresponds to water one for fire and one for air this is the earth one, I think it's called terra and you know how some wind chimes are kind of a little all over the place and when you listen to it for too long it just kind of sounds I guess you could say him. Well, Koshi wind chimes are not like that. They are tuned to sound really beautiful. All of the notes work together. I don't know exactly what the tuning of this one is. Uh, if you do, you can tell me. Maybe you have a musical ear. But I'm just gonna play it for you for a few minutes and you can let me know what you think and if you think it's relaxing. I find it so relaxing. I just kind of like to sit for a few minutes and 
just practice mindfulness. So let's see what you think. Are you ready? this alongside you. Yeah, you like it? Good. I'm glad. I might have to switch hands a few times. Maybe playing the Koshi chimes will help me build up some serious guns. <laughs> I kind of like the sound when it's like going around like this. along with you. You barely have to move it for it to sound. I found it's actually a lot better to move your hand up here than moving this thing. More of a natural sound.
Are you falling asleep? That's okay. I don't mind if you fall asleep. Verdict on the Koshi charts. Do you like it? Oh, awesome. I'm so glad. Do you want me to show you the next item that I brought for you? Okay. It's kind of different, but I love, I love this outfit. I am such a stickler for glass sounds, and I know you told me in the past. You also like glass sounds, right? Am I remembering correctly? Yes. Awesome. Well, I brought this small but mighty beaker, and let me tell you, this little baby makes some of the most beautiful lid sounds that I have ever heard. So, I would like to share those. And also, a little bit of glass tapping. What do you think? Are you up for it? Okay. You are such a good sport. Indulging me. <laughs> okay. Here we go. with a little tapping. Oh, the bottom sounds really different. I don't have those awesome long nails. Sorry. I just cannot. I'm just not a long nail lady. But I very much admire those who are. Okay. Are you ready for these lid sounds? <laughs> okay. I think this lid is so cool, by the way. Can you see that? little glass stopper. <laughs> that sounds so cool. I think it sounds so cool because the end of the stopper is frosted and the inside of the bottle is frosted too.
kind of a shame that so many things have switched over to plastic nowadays. I wish more stuff was made out of glass. You know, there's a lot of uh, scientists in my family and there's a lot of beakers at my grandparents' house. And I remember on the counter in the kitchen, there would always, always be this big beaker, like, not like this one, but way bigger, a triangle shaped one, full of rooibos tea. Because my grandpa was a very strong believer in the healing properties of rooibos tea. And every day, in the file, I don't know why they picked that vessel, but it's just something that I remember. using it as like a hipster mixed drink vessel, but nah. <laughs> Dried flowers is better. Washing this thing is not fun. And drying it, like I'm just noticing there's like a number six up here written really faintly. Either six or sixteen. Sixteen. Because there's also sixteen on here. Pyrex. It says Pyrex. I've heard of Pyrex before. And I don't know what it is exactly. I know it's like... I think it's a type of glass that is fortified with maybe it's like tempered glass so it won't break when it gets hot chimes? Of course. No, it's no problem at all. Just let me get them. Okay. But only because you're awesome.
know what? I feel better too. I can't listen to those chimes and not feel better. Not possible. <laughs> oh my gosh, thank you so much for coming out to see me today. I'm so glad we met up. Well, I feel wonderful and a little sleepy, so I think it's probably time for me to go to bed. You too? Yeah. Okay. Well, thanks again so much. It was great to see you. Take care. <laughs>